worried that you are spending too much time on certain apps you can actually set what we call a time limit for particular apps now of course this might be a part of a new year's resolution or of course maybe you want to use social media less and of course you want to limit the time you spend on a particular app you can actually set time limits as i'm about to show you now can apply to any app especially social media considering how addictive it can be all right so let's show you how the time limit setting goes so let's go into settings of course once you're in settings here you're going to scroll down you're going to go to screen time and once you're under here guys you're going to go into um you're going to go into app limit and of course here is where you're going to find these settings um if you want to as well just in case your setting is for a child you can use screen time passcode and of course it will require a passcode by default it doesn't require a passcode in cases where you want to bypass the limit just in case for kids you can go in here and set up the um, passcode it's straightforward just click on use screen time passcode that's something you may want to um, set either before or after you go on to setting that but i'm just going to show you how to set the app time limit so go ahead um, let's use our example let's say i want to spend less time on instagram i'm going to hit add limit I'm going to choose from here. Notice you have education and apps. You have um, productivity, health and finance, utility. And of course, the one we're dealing with has to do with social media. So select social media. And in this case, let's say it's Instagram. Um, I have the classic icon for Instagram. That's why my icon is like this. Your icon might look different. And of course, let's say I only want to spend a set time. I can set multiple apps. But here I'm going to hit next. And it asks me the time that I want to set for Instagram. All right, so in this case here, I'm just going to choose, let's say, a minute. And the reason I'm choosing a minute now is just to demonstration purposes. You can set hours. You can set um, hours and minutes. So if I wanted to, I could say one hour per day and one minute. Or, of course, one hour alone or one hour and five minutes. You do get the idea. In this case, I don't want it this long. I'm just demonstrating. So I'm going to set it to one minute, which is the minimum I can get away with. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and hit add. All right, and you see it here, it says app limit, and it says um, time check, five minutes remaining for Instagram today. All right, you get the idea. There are um, those um, notifications giving you updates. All right, so that's quite nice. And if I go ahead and use um, Instagram, of course, let's just find the Instagram app and use up some of that time. So I'm just gonna go ahead and launch Instagram. I'm gonna go over to my profile. You can see my profile here, guys. You can always follow me. And of course, as I'm going along, I'll show you what the notifications are like. So I'll just keep busy for a minute and we'll come back as soon as that notification warning about the minute that I have remaining. All right, guys, as you see here, guys, this is the time limit that I've been reached. It says time limit, which is just a minute. It says you have reached your limit on Instagram. And of course, it gives you the option here. Do you want to hit OK or ignore limit? All right. So in, if you hit OK, it means you have confirmed the time limit. And of course, ignore would mean that you want to go over the limit. But of course, this is warning you. And of course, as I said with the password, the password would um, allow you, um, prevent you from just ignoring it. In this case, let's say I'm agreeing with what's happening. So I'm just going to say, OK. And of course, there you go. It has basically stopped the Instagram app and it shows you the time limit here. There's a small hourglass. I don't know if you can see that right now, guys. Let me try to zoom a bit. Notice there's a small hourglass set. All right. So it's showing you now. That of course, Instagram has reached its um, limit. All right. So if you try to open it again, notice you'll be hit with the limit. And if you hit ignore and there's no password, it will simply remove. But of course, I could always um, hit OK as I showed you. Let me show you to remove this now, just in case you do not want this anymore and you want um, Instagram to function as normal. Remember, you can add multiple apps. You're going to come back in here. You're going to go to app limits. Notice you have. Um, Instagram here, you can turn off the app limits, or of course, you can come in here and you can delete the limit. In this case, I'm just going to go ahead and um, delete the limit. There you go. And of course, in other cases, guys, if you want to keep the limits in place, you can simply add multiple and have a profile and just simply turn off the app limits option. And later on, you can turn it back on if you do not want to customize each one, especially when you took the time to do that. All right, so that's how to set app limits. You can set this for games. You can set this for any app on your device at all. All right, guys, we're the garden again. Let's set a quick tip showing you to set your own app limits. Bye, guys.